All right, there we go. And we're live. We are live with a little bit of dredge, with a little tiny, tiny bit of dredge. Live. I saw a little bit about this this game over on Northern Lions channel. Uh, and it looks kind of fun. I didn't watch a lot of gameplay, but it it I was looking for indie games to play on this horror Friday. And lo and behold, I look at the Steam store and Dredge is right there under the horror category. So boom, here we are. I'm excited. I have read that it's an eldritch horror kind of game. It's not like pop out jump scare, which I kind of like. I like I like the uneasiness of it, but we're going to we're going to pop in some Dredge. Yeah, get a get a feel for the water, you know. And uh then we're going to hop over to Another game, whatever that game is, I have no clue right now, but uh, we will figure that out. Already, I, I have a hard time believing that this is under one gigabyte. <coughs> but we're going to pay attention to the story right now. Oh, you're screwed. You in the ocean, bro. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarks from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to the Great Marrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see we've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah, well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've, uh, I've had a few locals... Move thing, move your things to one of your old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep an, a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Ooh. Oh, here we go. He's wazed. A little, little tiny tugboat. Got it going. Wait. Rotate the camera and adjust with this. Okay. Yeah. For sure. Move to a fishing spot and press F. Okay. Easy. We put that in our inventory. We just smack that down. Do we do it again? I like this. Let's do it again. We're just loading up on mackerel. You don't have the right equipment for this spot. Okay. Yes, sir. I will promptly get out of your way. Hello, fish. Do I have equipment for this? Yes, I do. Oh, heck yeah. What is this? A cod. Mmm. You step on the dock at Great Marrow. The mayor is waiting nearby. Ah, so you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, you should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned to you earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you a replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so we'll cover it. We'll consider it a loan. But I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fishing sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? What is this socialist bullshit? I work so other people can get paid? Oh. Selling fish helps town and pays off my debt. Got it. Off you go then. 
Sow those fish uh, while they're still fresh. Got you. Let's go to the fishmonger. This guy looks very scary. Very menacing. Enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. Hmm. You're the new fisherman, eh? I'm surprised they found a new one so fast. Okay. What happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for your fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more, too. Okay, but what happened to the other fishermen, please? Other towns uh, on other islands might pay you different, but while you've still got an outstanding, a debt outstanding here, I'd suggest you work on paying it off first. So let's see what you've got. Okay, I have some mackerel and some cod. Can I sell that to you, please? Oh, sell it. Boom. Oh, how much is this? 16 bucks, boys? How much do we have? $84 from, like, a few fish. Heck yeah, dude. Okay, what can we do with that money? The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger's store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here, I found this by the docks. I'm sure someone like you could make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Okay. Yes, sir. Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Okay. I guess this is where I spend my money at. Hey, lady. As you walk in the yard, you see a shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take any damage on rocks or anything, any damage at all, I can patch it up. Okay. She shrugs, gestures, a number of wooden boards. Okay. Take a look around. Remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install, so plan ahead. A weighted line. We have the basic fishing pole right now. But I feel like the weighted line would be better. A skimmer? $75. This is $150. We can't even afford that. Let's try to get the skimmer. Right? Install. Two hours. Okay. How do I install it, though? Oh! I see. I see. I see. And I can't buy that one yet. So we gotta return to town. $35 remaining on the ship loan. What's in here? Cabin. Messages. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon, and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around this island and inklets uh and inklet inlets at the back of Greater Marrow. I love the rocks here. The layers and colors are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I will, uh, so I know he will keep his hands on the wheel instead of the rods. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Okay, so it's just a wife talking about her wedding. Cool. What else do I have? Encyclopedia? Oh. Cool. I want to go fish again. They told me to stay here at night, but I'm not going to wait. I want to go fishing. Hello, fish. Start. Easy. Get all these squid. I hope they sell for a lot. Okay, that's done. We go out and do some more fishing. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Panic. Okay. I don't think I'm very panicked right now, though. So we do more fishing.
easy. Oh, it's already depleted. That's lame. Do 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 do. Me and my sailboat going to the dock. Going to sell some fish. Hey, fishmonger. Do you ever sleep? What? What? I have a special order come through from a customer if you could fill it above normal prices. Gulf flounder and a gray eel. Shallow water fish. Okay. Well, while I'm here, let me just uh, sell these to you, buddy. How much is this selling for? 32? Heck yeah, dude. I'll take $32 for a fish. Any day. Alright, thanks, fishmonger. Appreciate it. Let's rest. Hey, there's some sharks. I don't know if we're going to be able to do that yet, though. Hey, sharks. What's up? Nope. I don't have the right equipment. We keep looking. Oh, there's a lot of stuff over here. Okay. Don't have the right stuff. Oh, and these are those uh, Tetris fish. Okay, we need to rearrange. We need to reorder. Uh, this goes like that. This goes like that. No, like that. And then we could fit we could fit a Tetris fish there, and then fit a little fish there. Yeah, there we go. It's depleted. Let's see if we can get one of these. Uh... Oh, that's a squid. Can I hold a squid? Yeah, there we go. We are full on fish. Let me sell stuff to this town over here. A trader. Uh, it's a brightly lit shop. Hello, is that? Um, no, uh, I don't believe we've met. Forgive my eyes, they aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets. Have you had anything nice with you? I got fish. I hope there's going to be upgrades to the boat later on. Because if that's as fast as it goes. <laughs> okay, I need a flounder. So today, our mission is to look for a flounder on this, this day. Hunched woman approaches me. Why are you here? I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. How do you guys eat then? Cause, cause somebody's gotta do the heavy lifting around here. And according to, according to the, the mayor guy, Whatever that guy was, you guys have a, a shit economy. I'm paying taxes to help you guys. Okay? I don't I don't give handouts. Except for when I have to. For tax reasons. Okay, that was weird. We got the fishmonger. Have you got the fish for that order? Not right now. Uh, okay. So we sell everything that we don't need, like this. We sell that, sell that, sell that, sell. <coughs> okay, now we store the eel. Storage. And now we sell this. And we have $150. We'll get some upgrades at the end of the night. But for now, we need to go find a flounder. Mayor, what's up? Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow? Would you take this package to the dock worker there, please? Yeah, sure, man. Small damp package found in string. Dock worker, they pay you upon de delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Compass and map, don't get lost. Yeah, it's like right across the way. I'm not dumb, Mayor. I'm a man of the sea. I'm a sea man. Okay? I delve in all things sea. But we fish on the way. I don't care if your package spoils. Okay, that was already depleted. Oh, those are flounder. I see them. I see them. I've spotted the target. Hey, 
Heck yeah, dude. And then fresh flounder probably go for a good price. I'll go ahead and get these and deliver them back to the fishmonger and then go deliver the package. Ooh, what does that mean? A trophy? Oh, but it's worth so much money. Do, 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 do. Uh, oh. Mr. Fishmonger, I got your order. I'll keep the order on ice. Okay, can we do this one? And then our storage. We have the eel. $39. A couple of squid and a whole black grouper. They only feed at night. Okay, I gotta go out at night. But we sell these for 50 bucks or for 18 bucks a pop. Can I sell this? No. All right, I only have seven cents remaining. Easy. I go deliver this package and we paid off our debt on the boat. Hmm, <laughs> what? A delivery? Let's see here. There's a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. Yeah, nice and fresh. This'll do nicely. Uh, I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but I didn't make much sense of it. You'll surely get more use out of it. He pulls up a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. The number of the pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. Tell me about it, brother. We go out and fish. We look for a black grouper and a squid. This is squid right here. One down. Well, if I get too many squid, I'm not gonna have enough room. Okay. Black grouper. That's what we need now. Hello? Any grouper out here? Oh! Oh, that was close. That was really close. Is this a grouper? I'm really bad. Just kidding, I'm a gamer. Black grouper! Let's go! There's one of them down. And then we can get another one right here. Oh, it's depleted already. And we made it through the nighttime, but everything's blurry. So we probably need to sleep. Peaches, 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 peaches. What does that mean? Why are there why are there crows? I don't like that. Get away! What the hell? Arrow squid lost to the birds? Look exhausted. Forget to sleep? Okay, yeah, I did. F I, I didn't forget. I just intentionally didn't sleep, man. Hmm. Got the fish? Yeah, I do. Squid? We got this squid? They're both stale. Sorry about that. Actually, let's do this one. I got a higher price. And then we got a grouper. Boom. $83. Eighty-three whole doll hairs. Okay. Stingray, sixty bucks. Dude, we're 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 rich. Okay. Mayor's walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood. Spring in a step. Fantastic news. Thanks partly to the efforts, uh, your efforts. Greater Mayor's growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted a consistent. A consent for the shipwright to expand her fish facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. Also, uh, I've allocated money to improve the fishmonger services. Okay. Okay. Awesome. Dry dock. What's that? Significant improvements. Extra space, more attachment, points for equipment, even superior holes. Cool. How do I get materials? 
I need something, right? I don't have any materials. So we go to the ship, right? A weighted line, a simple skimmer. Where do we have the simple skimmer? This one. Oh crap. I don't have a place for this. Okay, we need a refund for that, and I need to... Wait, if I uninstall that... I can't just uninstall stuff. I mean... Okay, let's uninstall this. Put it here. Put it here. No, it can only go on the bottom of the boat. Okay. What is this? Research part. I don't know what to do with this. But we'll see. Oh, I thought I could... Ugh. Okay. I don't know what to do then. Basic fishing poles, simple skimmer. Okay, but I need... Okay, I need to install this thing, I think. A weighted line. Bigger and deeper fish. But I don't have any space for it yet. Unless I get rid of this. Okay. I don't know. I don't know yet. Oh, it's already nighttime. I haven't slept... I didn't sleep last night, so I need to go and sleep. Oh wait, there's something shiny in the water. I'm gonna go look at it real quick. Lighthouse towers above. The waves crash endlessly against the rocks. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken and thrown at its feet. Yet, you ponder... It's intrinsic power of the structure. Okay. Alright. Is that all? I thought I was about to get something. It baited me. Alright, Mr. Fishmonger. Crab pots. Okay. I've got one here for you. In fact, it's uh, all banged up, but you can get it fixed by the shipwright. Okay. Thank you. Drop it out at sea anywhere. Cool. Well, Mr. Guy, uh, I'm gonna sell this, and I'm gonna sell this. And then... Oh, I could buy crab pots? Might as well. It's more money for me. And I can afford it. No, not the dry dock. I don't I don't need the dry dock. I don't have any materials. Go to the shipwright. I thought I could repair it. Oh, repair all. There. Let's put one here. Let's put one here. Let's put one here. We're just gonna go up this line. Let's put one here. And put one here. I think that's all of them. How do I, what do I use this for? I don't know, I saw something shiny over here though. Oh, that was it. We're kind of bleeding this area dry of fish. We might have to venture out into the deeper water. What the heck is that? An ugly mackerel. Corrupted scales and bulbous eyes. Nothing like you've ever seen before. 
wonder if it sells for a lot. Fishmonger. You have your hands on a growth or you hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raises up the fence to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. <coughs> ah, now this is a sort of specimen I live I, uh, to liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. Runs his fingers along the length of the fish as though feeling for something. It pushes from one side of its stomach, and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open from its stomach and pulls out a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Well, I've never seen that before in my days. I'll give you this thing, and I'll pay for the fish too, of course. It's not the first corrupted fish uh, I've seen in these parts. I'm sure we'll find more before too long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Why do you want the rotten ones? I'll put that with the other thing that I don't know what to do with. So, sell? Oh, sell all fish. Yes, give me some money. Now he's sleep. Oh. A man is looking you through the cabin window. His face is mostly in a shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. And I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Okay, so we gotta go south. We were already going out to the ocean. So that made our job a little more uh, worthy. Like, like time worthy. I guess. So we gotta go south out of here. Do, do, do. Going to see a creepy guy. Gotta go that way. Check the crab pots. Ah, oh, there's a crab! Can we take it? Pick up? Crab? This is what you call passive income. Whoa, a fiddler crab. Like a, a a diddler crab, am I right? Hey, fishmonger. Have you got any crabs for that order? I didn't even know I had an order, but I'm I'm glad I could use them. Sixty one dollars? Hell yeah! Bye, creepy fishmonger. I'm off to go south to meet another creepy guy. We need to figure out how to get more equipment. By more equipment, I mean, like, be able to attach more equipment. I'm guessing this is the town that that guy was talking about. The man is standing in the doorway, watching you approach. He's holding an old book in his hand. It's bound with crimson and silver ribbons. You came. Good. Now to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curi uh, curious. Is that how you spell curious? And, cu and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. Dude. All right. Don't talk poetry to me, bro. I'm not gonna fuck you. Okay? Just just tell me what you want. And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up in the flickering light and studies it. The patterns are unmistakable, even after all this time. This handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. <coughs> Okay. Okay. Dredge the wrecks in dark depths. Okay. Lost relics and reward you. Okay, thank you. You could have just said, hey, give me the handkerchief. And I'll give you money. Right? I need not give up your fishing career. Or you need not. 
Okay, yeah, sure. I'll sell weird shit to you. A ring, a necklace, a watch, music box, and key. Okay. Workshop? Oh, well. Why give me the option if it's locked? Later! Oh! If you don't mind me, I'll just be doing some fishing out here. Huh? Gotta make my paycheck for the day, boy. Hey, fishmonger, I got some fish. Alright, that's all. Bye. Oh, wait, lighthouse keeper. What is it? Continue, please? Oh. Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Back of the Greater Marrow with a current carries the wreckage from the sea. Okay. Sometimes you can see an unnatural glow rising from the uh, patch of dark water. Okay, so that's what we came across. Cool. Thanks. Who lives on Blackstone Isle? Okay. Anything strange? Trust my own eyes. No. This is just another of the fog's tricks. Alright, lady. I think you should take some medicine. Take take something. Take the take the edge off. I on the other hand am gonna talk to the builder. Woman sitting on the dockside staring out to see uh what's it like out there? I don't wanna talk about it. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward, moving along. It's not so bad here. Find the materials, maybe uh, you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can, uh, I can make a new place for myself out there. You'd be welcome to visit too. Just uh, stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything. Okay. Heard. Uh, lady, lady, I can help you out as soon as I figure out how I can get me some materials. Because right now, I can upgrade my boat, but I don't have shit to upgrade it with, and I don't know how to get it. So, lady, uh, you, you, you'll have to wait a second. Let me, let me sell this. I'm gonna sell this, right? That might be a mistake, but I think I need the weighted line. Oh, yeah. Install that. And then in the morning, I can go get the crab pots. And then after the crab pots, I can go get materials. Peaches, 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 peaches. I'm so excited to see the Mario movie. Everybody's been, been, been talking mad trash about it, but... I mean, I'm not excited for Chris Pratt, but I'm, I'm excited for Jack Black. And also... Uh, Anya Taylor Joy. I love every movie she's in. Yeah, I I'm excited about Anya Taylor Joy. I'm excited about uh, Charlie Day and uh, Jack Black. Seth Rogen. Eh, you know. Hello. Oh, it's just dolphins. Shapes in the deep. Start dredging! Oh wait, what? What am I doing? What am I doing? What? I have to change lanes and avoid gaps? This is so hard! Oh, this is so hard. I'm just a gamer. Can I get this stuff? Yes, we can get materials! Oh, come on. I just go here until I go there. Heck yeah. We get some old iron chains. Then after that, we go over here and get this stuff. And it's already nighttime? What the heck? We do that. 
research part. I still don't know what to do th with this. Oh wait, I can still dredge? Oh, metal scraps. That's big. Can I get some more metal scraps? I really would like to upgrade my ship. Ah! Let me put that there for now. And let me move these crabs around down here. And let's move this uh, uh, there so we can take the metal scraps and start dredging. Oh no, I don't have anywhere to put it. I, uh, that goes there. Okay, um, I need to make room. I can't move any of that stuff. Uh, I can do that. I can do that. I can do this. This, and do this. Boom. We're just good. Now I need to not die. Oh, shoot. I almost hit that. Just chugging along on the water. Going back to the dock. Is this... Oh, gosh. Turn back on. Uh, I don't know if this is the right... This isn't the right town. But that's fine. We sleep for the night, and we talk to this grieving father. Is everything okay? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Well, yes, you see, my son was lost to sea some years ago. Okay, sorry. Sorry, man. Bronze belt buckle? I have it. I don't know what to do with this, dude. Okay. Trader. Anything special lately? Sell all trinkets? What what trinket was it? I don't know. I just know I need to sell this fish before it spoils.